catch a snitch lacking on his balcony, Takashi. That nigga would have, that nigga would have tricked me. I ain't gonna lie. If it was a trick to trick a nigga to go to jail, he would have tricked me. He would have got me. I was in jail. Fuck it. Abyss said, "You cap, you can't fight at all." You probably right, but at this point in life, who's fighting anymore, bro? Probably can't. Who knows? I ain't gonna lie. I pray dude don't do no sh I can't beef with dude because dude would have did some shit like that to me. Oh, man. <coughs> we automatically catching the charge. Because <coughs> first of all, <coughs> you told me. <laughs> and nigga, <coughs> niggas can't say certain words. <coughs> you can't play with niggas certain way. You can't be like to another grown man be like suck my dick shit like that. Well, I'm a crash, boy. We both going to jail. I'm going to go ahead and lay down these little three, four months. It was no guns involved. It was no none of that. Most I'm going to catch is a year. I'm going to go ahead and go do that one time for the one time. Sometimes it be like that, boy. Please don't go through it with me. I can't go through it with nobody. I don't want to go through it with nobody. Because the way I be thinking, it always seems like, the way I be thinking how shit be going, it be like, damn, I'm probably, maybe I'm, I'm the petty one. Or maybe I'm really dumb. I don't know how to make good decisions. Please don't be for me. Please. I might not even argue with your ass. But when we see each other, we're not going to make no good decisions at all. I swear to God. I swear to God, we crashing. That's why I stay out people way. I stay out of the way because I'm going to be petty as a bitch. And you might be a nigga just like me. You might be petty too. Two petty niggas? Oh, shit. This shit about to get crazy. No, sir. Boy, you got me, boy. Some jail bids, it don't even really matter. I think it matters when you go to jail. Say you got a lot of money and you go to jail for some dumb ass shit. It be like, damn, it hurt you while you in jail. You're like, fuck, dog. I ain't even had to do no dumb ass shit. But certain shit, I ain't gonna lie. I don't go for how much money I got. Certain shit, I'll go to jail about. Like certain people doing life about people fucking hitting their mom. Somebody hit their mom and they probably went and whacked his ass. Shit like that, I would do jail about. Like, shit like about my mom, we just riding. We just riding in this bitch. I don't give a fuck. What? I'm probably one of them dumb niggas, cause I be in jail. I be in jail. I don't give a fuck. I be like, man, this shit ain't about nothing at all. I don't know why I feel like that, but it's a it's a good and bad thing. That shit don't do nothing to me. I ain't gonna lie, jail don't do nothing to me. But this time when I went to jail, it had me like, this shit real deal lame. Like the shit niggas talk about. Niggas talk about a whole lot of nothing, and niggas just make up stories in jail. So it's like, if you the niggas that's that I'm going against on the street. How the fuck I ain't got way more money than all you niggas? They're like, oh, nah. I'm going to fall back because jail will show you, boy. Niggas don't really be having shit going. You ain't finna have me have shit going. Ten years later, five years later, nigga like, damn, we still on the corner. ain't doing nothing. Nothing. I swear to God, some of the niggas I used to look up to been on the corner I, I used to watch them sell drugs on the corner growing up. Niggas, I was like probably 12, 13 seeing that. I'm like, damn, niggas doing it. Niggas living life. I got older. I'm I'm 23. I just turned 23. You niggas still doing the same shit. Oh, hell no. Nah. You niggas ain't living life. Hell no. Nah. You niggas real deal. Low key got nine to fives. Niggas that sell drugs, you real deal. If you ain't real deal, the brick man, you real deal got nine to five. I don't care you just made two, three bands today. Because your dumb ass got lock, get locked up. That lawyer money from the tax, especially if you selling hair on or son, You already know how they playing with that. The lawyer from the tax, you better not go against the feds because the feds going to whoop you. So you better hope it's a state case. Then now you back broke. Man, I ain't fucking with you niggas, man.
Hey, y'all, that's the street nigga life. That's how it used to be when, for me. Say, as soon as you get to your goal as a street nigga, say you want, say you got zero dollars and you trying to make five bands. It's like, as a street nigga, this is how life works. As soon as you get four bands, some shit will happen and set you back. Now you like, fuck, dog. Now you steady thinking like, damn, it's never going to happen. It's never going to happen. That shit going to happen, dog. Just stop chilling around them weirdos because them niggas ain't talking about nothing. Them niggas ain't talking about nothing. A whole lot of nothing. What? You just got to sit back and listen to what niggas talk about all day. You just got to sit back. Niggas not talking about nothing. I'm like, then we ain't going to talk about making no money or I if we selling drugs. Or if we scamming, y'all scam. Let me tell you about you scammers. Y'all scammers so dumb. Scammers be running up the bag. A year later, you return your lifestyle. Shit ass nigga. You just scam for 50, 60, 70, 200, 300,000, 400, 500, whatever you do. Man, listen, you dumb ass nigga. I would be trying to get a business. I'll be trying to, bitch, I would open up a studio. I don't give a fuck if I'm a rapper or not. I'm not, I don't got to go in there and rap. All you scammers want to be rappers. You don't got to do that. Open up the fucking studio and let these niggas rap. i uh, sign. All you young niggas, that's hard. You niggas don't even think about going legit at all. Property the biggest money, but you can lose in property. Don't just go do what everybody do because that's what all the white folks do. Talking about, oh, property, invest in some property. Nah, if I don't like doing that, I'm going to lose doing that. If I like doing rental cars, that's what I'm going to do. If I like fucking cooking, I'm going to fucking get restaurants or some shit. You got to do some shit you like or you're going to lose. It's not about property. You could do a fucking barbershop and win more than motherfuckers that got eight houses. Just because you got eight houses, what you doing with that? Bitch, I got nine barbershops. These bitches whamming. Stop playing. That's how you got to come. That's not some shit you like to do. All that property shit. Hey, Jack, when you going to get some? Man, fuck you. I got property. I got my house paid off. That's all I need. That's saying? Got a little apartment. I'm going to Airbnb that shit. Or rent you niggas and that's nothing. <clears throat> but I don't really like that. ain't really my wave, like getting property. But if I sooner or later, like, get to the point where I right, the money just super, super, super filthy. It's like, all right, I'm going to just get some property too because I know that's a hustle. But that's not going to be my first hustle. Fuck no. Just because you got rich off of it don't mean I'm going to get rich off of it. I could fuck up my whole life trying to copy you. So I'm going to go on my own little drip. You can't copy a nigga drip. Just because I got rich off of music don't mean you would get rich off of music. Look at Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart got that bag, and he on, he on funny time. You just got to find what you like to do, and man, I'm going to abuse this shit. I'm going to abuse this shit till this shit gives some M. All that other shit, I'm not doing what you like me to do. Fuck no. Fuck no. It's a faith in what you do. Like, at first, I ain't give a fuck about music. Now I like doing music. And because I like doing music, I could be in the studio by myself. I could record. I could just, you know what I'm saying? When, when it's time to leave, I'm going to put in a couple more songs in. I'm going to fuck it. We're supposed to go to 2 o'clock. Fuck it. Today, we're going until 4. Because I like doing it. I don't mind doing it. It's not really work. It's like I'm vibing still. I'm chilling. I'm making money doing something I like doing. I ain't gonna lie. Dior need to tighten up. I don't abuse that Dior shit. I don't abuse that shit. Bitch, say you're an alcoholic. I don't even drink like that, son. You sound stupid. I just started sipping for the last past like two months. I don't even be finishing my cup. One thing about me, I don't drink alcohol. I like to be on point. I don't, I don't like no drugs that's like I can't be alert. 
and alcohol a drug that if you drink too much, you cannot be alert. I could smoke all day, still be alert. That's it. <clears throat> I don't do lean because if you drink lean, you cannot be alert. I need to be aware of what's the fuck going on. That's it. All that other shit, all that high ass shit, I don't want to be that high. <clears throat> That's for you, nigga. That's them same niggas I was talking about in jail that don't be doing nothing. Them niggas that want to get that high. Yeah, you can want to get high, but you trying to get too high. Like, you can't even, you can't even real deal function. You niggas falling asleep, stand, nah, man, you niggas crazy, man. Niggas be ripping it, man. Niggas crazy. Say righteous, that part. Say, what if it's hard finding something you like? It's going to be like that. It was hard for me to find something I like. I didn't like music. <clears throat> so if it's hard finding something you like, at that point, you just got to go with the flow. That's saying you just got to be a hustler and still go with the flow. You know how to get money. You know what the fuck you do. If you like watching movies, if you like play shit so real now how the internet set up, you could be in the house playing a fucking game all day. If you like doing that, you could get you some money. My little brother, fucking 13, 14, I told him the other day, I said, and I was playing with him, I was like, how you gonna contribute to this shit? That little nigga told me, I'm finna, he said, get me three monitor screens, and I want a gamer chair, and I want to do streaming. So if he 13 already thinking like that, like, damn, my brother Jack Boy, I could finesse off of streams on YouTube, yo ass supposed to be doing something, you know what I'm saying? You better find son you like stay ass in the house and play the game and put that bitch on YouTube. I'm talking about mother motherfuckers will watch you watch a movie on YouTube. That shit is so real. YouTube fucked up right now. What? I got a joint every time I'm awake. He said I like basketball, but I play football. All right, sometimes it be like that. What you like is you you a, you an athlete, that's all. It's not I like basketball, I play football. Yeah, you might like basketball a little more, but you might be wrong in football. Football might be the one that give you them M's. Uh-huh. Basketball, your ass might get dunked on by LeBron. LeBron putting his nuts all on your face. You talking about basketball. But yeah, I better go play football. And you ain't see Tom Brady, boy. You better, better go do some Tom Brady shit, boy. Or some Mahomes shit. Mahomes got like 400, 500 M's. But yeah, it's better go play football, boy. You talking about, you might be that wrong football. You talking about you like basketball. What's your mom like, basketball or 500 M's? At that point, you got to be smart in life. What do my mom like, basketball or 500 M's? Some niggas, you might be one of them niggas that you could just do a lot of shit. Some niggas could do a lot of shit. Yeah, you might be raw in basketball, but bitch, I'm going to go get this bag on football because I know I could abuse y'all over here. A bitch say you banned from the 954. I be in the 954. I'm talking about like every day, boy. Yes, it's stupid, boy. <laughs> All them zombies down there? How the fuck? <laughs> you stupid, boy. You an asshole, man. Niggas be assholes, man. <coughs> I might move back. I might move back. I might get y'all this shit over here. Go live in Haiti. We bring the land that I ate and my other shits to Haiti. You say too much dead off somewhere alone. They said, all them charges and you ain't get deported. 
<laughs> they tried a couple times. They tried a couple times. You know, I'm a little finesse. They tried. When Donald Trump came in office, they tried to deport me. I said, what? Oh, hell no. Nah. They say, nah, it's that woo. <laughs> oh, man. It's that what, fam? <laughs> oh, man. That boy say, it's that woo. They say that blunt burns slow as fuck. I rolled that like that. They say you born in Haiti, of course. Even with that American passport, my passport ain't American. My passport say Haiti on it. I, pa I got my passport from here, but where it say place of birth, it says Haiti. Don't make me go pull out my passport, man. 